for my video. Tell me a little bit about your project here. Okay. As somebody who doesn't know what's going on. Sure, sure. Um, so my name is Rachel Hoffman, and I took the Intelligent Machine Design Lab course at UF this summer, or this past semester. Um, and so the intelligent machine that I chose to build is called the Drumbot. Basically what happens is there's an Xbox uh, Connect hooked up to my laptop, and then I have a program that tracks the motion of my arms, and it shows that whenever my arm hits a certain position, that's like I'm hitting one of the drums. So the robot itself actually plays those drums. So. All right, so can you uh, play something musical instead of just random stuff? Uh. Is, it, is it that responsive? <laughs> It's, it's, it's a prototype. Now do a fill. Oh Here. god. That's like all those random noises. Now is this something that I can try or is it only yeah, calibrated please. for you? Yeah, you can come try it. Just come stand in front of the connect. Alright, can you hold this? I would love to. Here you go. So just go ahead and take my place. So each each box is a drum, and your hand has to leave like the box for it to correspond that it is actually hit. Does that make sense? Yeah. Is it, it works going down or up? Uh, it should, yeah. Okay. <laughs> this is super awkward. I know. I, I never played any of these games either. Anyway. Now I'm super impressed that you're able to keep that beat. <laughs> I know, yeah. So, you know, the whole point of this course is it's it's a prototype, right? So it's not for mass mass production or anything. Um, and actually looking back on it, I think it might have been a little cooler if I had chosen to do uh, like a xylophone instead. I don't know, I think it's more interesting because you have different sounds. Sure, I, I mean, either way, it would have been cool. I was just, in the end, I, was, I guess I was hoping for a little bit more oomph behind it. Wait, what's with it rolling? Okay, so that's like its um, other mode. I call it like parade mode. So if you put, you see like near your head, there's a um, like a purple box on the screen. Right. If you put both of your hands in that box and then slowly take them out like one at a time, yeah, so that's like it's parade mode, I guess. So it just kind of wanders around, and you can still play drums. It just kind of wanders around, and then to get it to stop, you put your both your hands in there and then take them out again. It, that part's a little finicky, but okay. So you have. Well, <laughs> I try. I, I color coordinated it uh, wrong, <laughs> but it, it's easy to fix. I just forgot to go back and do it. Well, that's cool. Thanks for yeah. bringing it by and showing it. To You're me. welcome. It shouldn't hit you. Maybe it did a little. Well, the drum hit me. The box didn't. Yeah. Because it's got with this little bump on it, right? Yeah, but it's supposed to be like a bump switch, so that if it actually does bump into anything, it'll be like, oh, I hit something accidentally. And it stops. So. Well, that's super cool. I want to get some pictures.